things. Ready? Hello, welcome to another video on the JT12's RC Videos channel. Now, we've just successfully broken in this engine, the 18 sized engine on the Kyosho 2.0 DBX buggy. Now, we're going to do a tuning tutorial. Now, I'm not going to touch the low speed needle because, in all honesty, I haven't needed to, so I do not recommend, unless you need to. Um, you, I don't think you should touch the low speed needle. If you do need to, in which case, then check out my low speed needle tuning tutorials. But I'm personally not going to touch this one because I don't need to, and I don't think most of you guys will need to. So in this video, we're going to be looking at how to tune the high speed needle. Okay, so we just we just uh, completed a five tank standard braking procedure uh, for this one. Okay, now throughout the braking procedure, as always, we have the engine running rich. This means more fuel and less air. Now. When the braking process is finished, we now need to start leaning out the engine uh, because that amount of fuel in the engine isn't necessary any longer. We need to start leaning out the engine to get more performance. Leaning out means more air, less fuel, or less fuel, more air, whichever way you want to look at it. Okay, so for tuning, a few points I need to make. Uh, just fill up your tank. By the end of this one tank, your engine will be tuned. It's as simple as that. Basically, in this uh, tutorial, what we're going to do is we're going to start the engine up. When you tune an engine, it always needs to be operating temperature. So don't tune a cold engine. So we're going to start this up. We're going to make sure it's warm just by running it up and down a few times. Then we're going to gradually lean out the high speed needle. That's this one just here. We're going to lean out the high speed needle one eighth of a turn, which is about from there to there, one eighth of a turn at a time. Okay. So like I say, let's start up the engine and let's get the engine up to operating temperature. Okay, so at the moment the engine is running very, very rich. You can tell this by the blue exhaust smoke. And this is full throttle. So it's not, I wouldn't say it's slow, but I wouldn't say it's fast either. There's a lot of fuel going in there from the braking procedure. Okay, so once the engine is warm, let's bring it back. Let's turn the high speed needle one eighth of a turn clockwise. So we're closing off that fuel tap and we're leaning the mixture. Well, once again, just to confirm that means. Leaning off the mixture means less fuel and more air. So let's do that. The engine is reaching a higher RPM. Okay, let's bring it back and do another adjustment. adjustments if you do big adjustments at a time then what's going to happen is you're going to go too lean and you're going to actually miss that optimum setting so that's why we just do small one eighth of a turn clockwise adjustments at a time let's see the performance increase now you remember what it was at the beginning all we've done is two eighth of a turn adjustments let's see what the performance is now so it's even better now Ah! <laughs> 
much it to be honest guys once you're happy with uh, lean being clockwise rich being counterclockwise you can just play around with your settings and get your settings to something that you're happy with personally i'm going to leave this engine running a little bit rich hence why i'm just riching it back out a little bit because it's still a new engine it's only had five this will be the sixth tank foot put through it so we're not going to want to run it too uh, lean just yet but in all honesty <laughs> I'd say it's running pretty well. So thanks very much for watching guys and more videos are coming soon of course you need to hit that red subscribe button if you want to see a maiden bashing session of this one. But apart from that, I've been Josh, you guys have been awesome and thanks so much for watching and stay tuned, more videos are coming soon.